things about this market that we can use our money multiple times a day and we get the result now. I'm not looking for a result in six or 12 months. People come up to me and say, Dave, why don't you become a share investor and do this and do that? Why? This gives me the result I want now. I want the money now. Who wants the money now? Yes. I am bloody greedy. I have got a problem with it. I do. When I'm trading, I get greedy. Is greedy a good thing? Yes. Not all the time. <laughs> Most of the time it is. But I want the result now, and I'm willing to put in the few hours that I need to do that. So that's pretty cool. Trade. So you can live trade a couple of hours a day, or if you're really lazy, you can put the auto trader on. Who likes the sound of that a little bit better? Bloody, you guys have just got to get some excitement in your life. So we're going to talk about the auto traders, but you have the ability to trade live or get the machine to do it for you. And I'm going to tell you all about the benefits that that's coming out as well. Small capital outlay to start trading is the key. When you start any new business, and trading is like a new business, isn't it? Yeah. The market is just the market. It's there, it's got plenty of money in there if you know how to pull it out. It's just like if you started up a McDonald's franchise. They're pretty profitable, aren't they? But there's a business model around pulling people's money out of their pocket, isn't it? It's the same as the markets. If you have a really good business plan, it's not about the money. If you have a good business plan, if you have good trade management, money management, rules, discipline, all this stuff, you can pull as much money out as you want. As much money as you want. A guy said to me not that long ago, he said, Dave, what does it feel like? What does it feel like to be able to just go to the market and get the money whenever you want? What do you think my answer was? Bloody great. Bloody great. <laughs> it is fantastic knowing that. Like you guys right now, how most of you, so I'm not going to put all of most of you only know how to get money from the job. I go to the markets whenever I want money, and it's exciting, it's fun, and guess what? They pay the same day. I don't have to chase invoices or anything like that, wait till Friday to get paid. We get paid that day. So when you make the money, you can pull the money out of your account that particular day. So that gets me going. Simplicity of index trading. This is simple. Don't let anyone tell you that it's difficult to become a day trader or trade the e-minis. It is not difficult. To enter a trade is one click of a mouse button. Before we click that button, we've already predefined what we're willing to risk and we've predefined our reward on the trade. So it's what's called trade management. So once we enter the market, that's, we're a bystander. So we just watch what's going on and we'll either go into profit or loss. As simple as that. So anyone in this room, you can do it. It's not about putting this order on and that order on and, and 40,000 different orders. It's simple, one click, and it's all set up. If anyone needs help through their computers, if you're not computer illiterate and you think, you know what, I don't know how to look after computers, as long as you can start it up and turn it on, we can set the rest up for you. We can come into your computer and set the trading dome up, set the charts and all that stuff and show you how it all works. Okay, so that's not even an excuse. So be, is everyone be able to click a button, yes? Yes. Absolutely. So anyone can do this. And I'm going to show you um, a few cool things to make it even easier. So do you guys want to see some live trades? Yes. Do you want to see a slow one or a fast one? Fast. You guys like action, right? Rightio. We've got to start off with a slow one. I'll just speed him up a little Just getting a little bit closer here to the actual trade. This is of the live trading room that we have. All right, they're coming down here, looks like. All right, good enough for me. 1,067 guys, I just placed the order. All right, so what I'm going to show you here on the board, we're looking to sell here. So we can make ma money when the markets are going up or down. 1,067, okay? I'm going short. So at just this particular, we've got an order. If you can't see the price, don't really worry, but 1,067... We're going short five contracts. Can everyone see the five on the side? So we need this market, which is the yellow line there. We need the market to come back up and fill our contracts. And once it does, what you'll notice is we've already got a predefined stop loss, which will be a red line that appears. And also a profit target, which will be a green line that appears. So watch out for those two things. Okay, here they come. So we're going to go short 1,067. 
All right, so we're about to enter right, this trade here. Now. See if I can fix this up. Oh, a couple of ticks. <laughs> Bloody hell, wait till I pull out the hundreds. What's going to happen then? <laughs> Come on, pop up. All righty, so how many contracts up. we go in here, guys? So we're going five contracts. So to trade five contracts, we need... You need five hundred dollars oh, in your account to trade one contract. A a it's not what it's worth, but to All trade right, one contract, here, we need five hundred dollars. So to trade five contracts, how much money do we need in our account? No, Two and a half. Geez, you guys us. are smart in oh, Queensland. Just missed us again. <laughs> now the way we trade, we got hit that time actually. We're about to get filled into this trade. We have what's called a one-point stop loss or a four-tick stop loss. So once this trade gets entered here. All right, we're getting hit again. Yeah, all right, I'm all right. So we filled now. So, so you see that red line, guys? Automatically, yeah, that's out what's called a stop now. loss. Okay, and the green line is our profit target. Now, Can you notice that, that our profit target is twice as big as our stop loss? Okay, in trading, if you haven't got this right, today, if you haven't got a two to one ratio in day trading, you're in trouble. You're in big trouble. Okay, so you need to be going for a lot more on your winning trades than your losing trades. Keep your stop loss short. So, my risk on this trade is how much? One point or equal to $250? That's my risk, $250 here. Now, if the market comes down and hits that green line, that's my profit target. My reward, normally on two points, would be $500. But remember that problem I told you I've got? What am I? Greedy. A bit greedy. So we go for a little bit more. Is going for a bit more profit okay? Yeah. yeah, most of the time. So on this particular trade, if it works, we'll make six twenty-five. dollars Okay? Now, six twenty-five. how much money did we need to execute the trade? Two and a half grand. Our reward on the trade... Will be six twenty five. What's the return on investment? Now. Come on, push him down. Come on. About twenty five percent. Twenty five percent. This trade takes about thirteen minutes. Do you want me to speed it up a little Come bit? Come on. Push down. All the markets are pushing back down now, guys. All right, I just want to show you one thing that we've actually done right here. You'll all see. To see that red line now has come down a little bit. We brought that red line down to where that yellow is. That yellow bit was our entry point. Okay, right now on this trade, we can't lose. So it's what's called a risk-free opportunity right now. So we're in the trade, we said, okay, if this doesn't go down and hit our green line, we don't want to lose any money on this particular trade. Okay, so it's just trade management. So it's starting to get down to our profit. We're looking for a push down here. 64.50. Come on. You just need more. I'll just speed it up a little bit more. So now you can see I've actually bought the red line in front of the yellow line, which means now if it goes back and hits that red line, I would be stopped, up, stopped out of the trade but in a profit. Okay, you can't go broke making a profit, can Get you? sellers here. Russell's going down again, guys. Come on, break down here. Give us some money. Be nice. You've got to talk to the markets nicely. And they'll do what you want. Here we go. We've got the pressure on all the markets again on the downside, guys. This is going to work. Come on. This time. And the Russell's dropping. Here we go. Here we go. Needs a bit of excitement, guys. Come on, keep pushing. A little bit more. Come on! We just need this to push a little bit more, guys. One more tick. Here we go. It's hitting... It's going to hit the 64.50. Here we go, here we go. Come on, push. <laughs> One tick. Come on. Oh, it went through all 6475 contracts there. It's gagging me. 
just holding here. That's why I just threw my headset down, I think. <laughs> All right. It needs a Queen Queensland cheer. Everyone stand up. Everyone stand up quickly, quickly. All right, cheer this home. Come on. Come on. Oh, come on. Louder, louder, louder. <laughs> come on. Oh, oh. Yeah. <laughs> that wasn't too bad. You guys are pretty good. Did that, did that get a little bit more exciting towards the end? Imagine holding that trade for six months. How bloody exciting would that be? <laughs> Not. So that trade took roughly about 13 minutes. 13 minutes it took. Do you think that's pretty cool? So we used $2,500 we were only risking, this is what matters, doesn't it? It matters what we were risking. We are risking 250 bucks to make 625. That's pretty cool, isn't it? To get a 25% return. It's insane, isn't it? So guys, do you want to see the fast trade? Yeah. All right, I might need to get you to stand up for the whole time because it's really fast, but we'll see. All righty, so this next one. Where is it on the top? In this particular one, we're going to go what's called going on the long side. So we're looking to buy five contracts this time, and we want the market to go back up. So to buy five contracts, how much money do we need again? Two and a half grand. Our risk is the same. Our risk is always the same. I never risk any more. So my risk is how much? 250. My reward. We're in the trade? All right, we'll talk about the reward in a second. This one's moving around a little bit faster, isn't it? Can you hear me breathing differently? <sighs> Bloody exciting, gets the heart beating. All right, so I'm going to go for a little bit more profit because I told you I had a problem about that, didn't I? I like making more money. So see right now the green line's at 906.25. I'm going to move it up and go for an extra one point. So what I did to move the order was simple one click. Another thing that I'm going to do now is protect the trade. Alrighty, so now what I've done here is I've moved, can't see it, but I've moved the stop loss, which is the red line, above our entry point. So it's the risk-free opportunity again. So if it comes down and hits that red line, I'll be out of the trade. If it goes up and hits the green line, I'll have made three points. Okay, three points on this is 750 bucks. It's all US money too. Is that a good or a bad thing? It's a good thing. It's worth more than the Aussie buck, right? So our return on investment, if this works, would be how much? 30%. 30%. But we're only risking. This is what matters, doesn't it? That's what we're risking. That's our reward. Are those levels okay? It's pretty basic starting level, isn't it? Okay? Alrighty. So, we need everyone to stand up again. This is a fast trade. So, until you start cheering, I'm not going to play it. Alright. Louder, louder. Oh. Push, push, come on! Yeah. Go, 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 go! Ah, come on! Oh. Oh. Hey. 
That was bloody exciting, wasn't it? Who would like to risk 250 to make 650? How long did that trade take? Took about one and a half minutes. That's a lazy trade to trade, isn't it? Because once you've got the money, what can you do? You can reinvest it, you can spend it, you can go to bed because your job's done. Your job's done. In that particular, what's it, about 900 bucks Australian for a couple of minutes' work? You don't need to stay there. Now, that was, that was a couple of warm-up ones. I'll show you a trade the other day, the day in the room. It was just a bit of a make-up one because I was down a little bit. That happens too, right? So, on this particular trade, I was on the Russell. So, we went six contracts on this. So, we needed in our account 3000 bucks to do this trade. My risk on this particular one was 480 bucks. My reward, when it went my way, was 2400 What was the return on investment there? <laughs> Insane, right? <laughs> the trade took 10 minutes. That's the power of these markets. And I'm talking about trading five contracts here. Normally I trade 50, sometimes more, but I don't take any more risk. Okay, so when I'm starting, sometimes I get to more contracts in the trade and sometimes I can have even up to 150 contracts, but I'm never risking any more than my initial risk at the start. Okay, that's what's very important. I'm very risk averse. I always protect my capital first. Professional traders, write this down. Professional traders protect their capital first. The upside will always be there. But you need to look after your business. You need to know your risks. Most people come into the market thinking, how much money can I make? And that's a trap. Because the upside's there. When you get it right, you can make as much money as you want, trading many, many different styles. Okay? But for me, personally, I like to trade that fast. And I like to do that multiple times a day. Because it's exciting. It gets my heart going faster sometimes. I look at the trading dome and it's got crazy money there. And I have to laugh at it. Who would like that problem, by the way? <laughs> I feel you. It is exciting. It's exhilarating. It's challenging. Every single bloody day I get up. I know when I go to that chair and I'm in the markets, I've got a battle in my hands, on my hands. Because there's other people who want to take my money, but guess what? I'm better than most at it. So I can get their money most of the time. And that is a great feeling that when I go into the markets, that basically I control everything I do. I've got no one else telling me anything. I control how much money I make. Who would like that? Yeah? Get a show of hands. You control your future now. This weekend is about you. It's not about anyone else. It's not about the person next to you, your family, your friends or whatever. This is about you. And remember that. When you go into trading or any investment or anything past this weekend, it's about you. And you can make anything happen because it is bloody possible. And it's fantastic. And trading is one of the most fun things you could ever do. It's bloody exciting and a hell of a lot of fun. Alrighty, so moving on from that. Six minutes. So, show me the money. Do I got to keep showing you guys the money? Hey? Oh, I'll put the, wait, hang on, I'm just going to hide. No, no, I'm not going to hand out any more money yet. This is a simple money management plan, guys, getting a few winning trades a week. Okay, I'm not talking about getting 10 winning trades or 20 winning trades or anything like that. I'm talking about getting a few winning trades a week. If you can achieve that starting with a $5,000 account, trading three contracts, okay? Trading three contracts, you're looking for three wins a week, which would be about $900. That's what you're looking for. Because trading three contracts, you'd be risking $150 to make $300 basically per trade. But it's okay to go for a little bit more profit now and again, isn't it? Okay, so that three winning trades, sometimes it could be just two. It could be one. But what it's about is getting one winning trade, two winning trades, whatever it may be, consistently. Because consistency is everything. It's no use being able to get one winning trade or two winning trades. It's about consistently making money 
week after week, month after month. Okay, you're going to have some knockbacks now and again, but once you, get the, once you get this right, you can make money week after week, month after month, year after year. If you can just get one winning trade a week, that winning trade could be a thousand bucks, could be ten thousand, it could be a million bucks. Okay, anything is possible, but it's about being consistent. So getting three wins a week is not that difficult most of the time. So if you started off with a $5,000 account, I'm not talking about a $50,000 account, I'm talking about a $5,000 account, you'd be looking to go for around $3,600 for that month. And then once you hit the target, then go to four contracts per trade. What people fall down with sometimes is they go from three contracts to how many? Six, 10, 12, they go too fast. Okay, everyone's okay with making money, but sometimes you have a few losing trades in a row. You might have a losing day. You might have a maximum stop out day. You need to be happy with that amount of stop out. Okay, to move to the next level. If you've got 3,600, I'm not very good at shooting here, it's not working. There we go. If you've got 3,600 extra in your account, do you think you'd be okay to go up one more contract and risk an extra 50 bucks a trade? It wouldn't affect you too much, would it? And then, once you hit that level, 4,800, go to five contracts per trade. Once you hit the next level, go to six. The first year, or when you're starting to trade, is not about the money. It's about learning to trade. Because in your first year, I'm not here to teach you or tell you that you're going to make a million bucks in the 12 next 12 months, because it's not the reality of what's going to happen, okay? In my trading next year with things I've got coming out, I believe there'll be a millionaire made next year from the student. But most of you, would you be okay if you made it between 100 and 200 grand? Would you be okay with that? Raise your hand. Yep. Okay? Most people would be happy with that. If you follow something simple like this, it is possible. Going up slow. Because the first year is not what it's about. Because once you know how to do this and make money consistently, it's about when you get to 20 contracts a trade and 30 contracts a trade, 40 contracts a trade, do these levels get a bit more exciting a month? <laughs> Hell yes! Absolutely! But you can't go straight to these levels. Okay, it's not the reality. But when you make your money is in your second, third, fourth years, and you can make as much money as you want. Okay, but it's very, very important to get your foundation right from the start. Get your base, learn yourself, learn the rules, learn the markets, learn how to make